Hey, what's up everybody? How you doing? Welcome back to Carpo Gaming and another Destiny 2 Lightfall video. Today we have the Vex Caliper Authorized Override Quest. It's going to be real short, sweet, right to the point, and I'm going to walk you through these step by step. Let's go! Once again, thanks for watching everybody. Without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, let's get started. You're first going to have to beat the Vex Caliper Quest in order to get this now. Check out that video right there if you want to get that brand new exotic. After you visit the war table and pick it up, you're going to have a brand new quest called the Vexcalibur Authorization Override. It's only three steps, but I'm going to walk it through you. The very first step, you're going to have to defeat Vex, and that's probably why you're watching this video. I know a real cool spot where you can form Vex. Over on the moon, you want to spawn into the Horror Sauber landing zone. Right over here is going to be where the old raid was. Over here is going to be a really good spot where we can form Vex. Now, the reason why it's a great spot to form Vex is one, you're going to be by yourself. You don't have to worry about anybody stealing kills from you, so to speak. And number two, there's a lot of them that come out of here. It took me about 15, 20 minutes to get this step done. And the most of the time you're going to be using is going from one zone to the next to respawn the enemies in. But, you know, that's what I'm going to do. And I'm going to walk you through it. Now, when you first come over here, we'll be a hobgoblin over here and you know can drop some pretty good loot too of course they're going to be on a countdown timer after you take them out a couple times and you know have fun with that because you can get some good loot after that you want to make sure you have your vex caliper and just start killing all of these different vex that's going to spawn in this is the old school spot where we used to farm the raid and before you know it there's going to be a huge boss that's going to come out but before that it's going to be a ton of vex now after you finish taking out the boss and taking out all of the vex hop on your speeder and scoot on over all the way back to the zone that we came in and like i said no worries i'm going to walk it through you right here right now step by step so i got you covered the very first step is going to take the longest and i'm just trying to save you some time so hopefully if you're watching this video you'll be good to go now once you see the sorrels harbor come up on your screen you can then turn around and head right back to where we was just forming those vex all the enemies will reset and now all you have to do is just watch rinse and repeat and just like that like i said 15 20 minutes you'll be done with this part of the quest step the quest will update and you're going to get a new step and we need to equip the basic authorization override mod to the excalibur so now we can start leveling it up and getting those different perks in the future. So head over here and get that authorization code into that weapon and a quest will update. Now we just need to visit the war table for step number three. I told you it's gonna be really fast. And the most time you're gonna spend is farming the Vex. So head back over to the helm and now all we have to do is head to the war table and collect our loot. And we get some pretty good loot. You get a nice powerful drop, you get a nice a lovely engram as well and the quest is completed just like that so boom there you have it ladies and gents i hope you truly enjoyed it as always if you're new to the channel how you doing and welcome don't forget to subscribe right here at carpo gaming upload a wide variety of videos ranging from updates tips and tricks guides and news and a whole lot more so hopefully you enjoyed this video once again thank you everybody for all your love and support and as always i'll be seeing y'all in the next one later